which emote is the best? I think iPhone clearly is the winner. It's connected to the internet so you can check the TV program. It has huge high resolution touch screen and it's always with you. One problem with it, it's not a remote at all. So let's turn your smartphone into a remote. First, let's check the competition. What? 50 bucks for the remote? That's crazy! We'll build ours for a tiny fraction of this price. All we need is two 940nm infrared LEDs and an audio plug that fits your smartphone. Attach the two LEDs to the plug like it's shown on this picture. Long like of one LED and short like of another LED go to the large tab on the plug. The rest of the LED legs go to the rest of the plug connectors. Your remote is ready. It can look as ugly as this one or a bit nicer, like this. Now plug this remote into the headphone socket on your smartphone. Make sure the volume is cranked up to the maximum and open this web page in the web browser. Select the device you want to control, then click on the appropriate file, like power.wave to turn the power on. You don't actually need an iPhone and the internet for this hack to work. You can download those files to any device that can play that .wav sound files, such as any smartphone like Android or Blackberry, most MP3 players, many dumb phones, and even your PC. What I like most about this remote is how easy you can find it. You can just call it or use MobileMe.